Okay, hello everyone, I'm Cypho aka Funky, and I'm having a look at the Commerce built-in store system for Guild Wars 2. This is the main page, um, some featured items are here, and you get 2,000 gems as a bonus for um, for the beta, just so you can uh, test it out. So if you go to Style, you can find things like uh, making gear better with transmission stones, you can have a look at the cook's outfit, scholar's outfit, pirate mate's outfit, and then a cool ringmaster hat. So I must have a look at that. Consumable, a dye pack, some magic plant food, which grows a colorful seed into a dye plant instantly. So that's part of the dye system. And a mystic key will unlock one mystic chest. Mystic chest can be found randomly on enemies or hidden places in the world. Okay, and then there's account bonuses like unlock a bag slot and a bank tab. Boosts at the moment XP, Karma, and Magic Find boost. I think that will be a good one to get. Um, and then minis. So mini packs. This pack comes with three random selected minis, two common and one uncommon to enter your collection. Minis are tiny models of your favorite monsters. So, okay, I'll get one of them. Thank you. Alright, so it should come in the mail. Yep, there we go. I have a new message here. There we go. Minis pack, take all. Congratulations, you've learned how to finish off a fallen enemy. Now that was part of the um, PvP introduction quest that I did. So let's open up our inventory. And there we go, double click to receive three selected minis. Okay, ooh. Oh my god. Right off the bat, mini soldier. Oh my god. How do I uh, use? Oh, I already did. So double click or right click use. And there's. Oh my god, look at this. There you are. Hello, I have a mini soldier. Okay, what's the other fellas? A dread resonator. Oh, cool. Okay, very nice. Let me see the front of him. What's he look like? Cool, and a mini swamp spider. Oh, good. Sambo would hate this one. Amazing. I'll just keep Zolja out for, for the moment. Takes a little while to load her, but there, yeah. Woohoo! Okay, now, um, what you have here, that's basic store, and then you have currency exchange. So you can do stuff right away trade gems for gold, or trade gold for gems. Uh, currently, looks like there's nothing happening on this. Oh, wait. There we go. I'll trade for gold, gems, I'll trade, there we go, just took a little while to load in, and <laughs> the price has gone all the way down, so it keeps up to date sales, it's amazing, uh, now this one's a trading post, I'm pretty sure this is a on to go, on you go, mobile auction house at the moment, look at that, 2,800 orders, metal scrap, that's the top demand, top supply, top value, and top traded. Sell. Yep, here we go. Just sell your stuff here. Um, so I'm pretty sure everything will be delivered by the mail system. Oh. I should sell mini soldier? No, I'll never do that. Sorry, I'm not. My listings, I have none. And pick up. Oh, okay, so there you go. Purchased items will be here, and trade profit will be there. Excellent. So that is the commerce tab. A combined auction house and gem store and uh, I don't know what else I'll buy but I'll have a look at it later on uh, you can press view all items there we go and get more gems down the bottom there which it says beta special limit reached during beta weekends gem purchases are currently limited to one transaction per account if you do not have purchased Gem, any gems during beta and you are seeing this message please contact support so there you go I have 1700 gems left but I have a mini Zolja isn't she lovely oh hello sorry about that kind of reversed into you you're not wearing shoes yet you're standing on on snow that's right Norn there's a beautiful rabbit here okay well I think that's about it I'm getting way off topic I'm just going to stand here with my mini Zolja and uh, say goodbye. So I hope you enjoyed this little video on the Commerce tab. And keep an eye out for more Guild Wars 2 videos. Bye-bye.